Hello and welcome to Do Good Films once again. My name's Jordan Dugid and you are here for an unboxing. I'm gonna jump straight into it. I need to think of a catchphrase to be honest to open my videos because I am awful at introductions. Today I'm gonna be unboxing Loot Crate DX January 2017 and the theme is Origins, I believe, which is the same as the normal Loot Crate. Um, this is my second Loot Crate DX box. I did receive one in December, but I wasn't doing videos at that time, so this is the first one that I'm unboxing, and I'm very excited, cause I friggin' love geek stuff, especially expensive stuff. So I'm gonna put all of the pricing and details in the description below. Let's crack this open. Uh, so once you open the box, this is what you will see. Stuff, lots of stuff, maybe. So I will do the shirt last. Oh wow, okay. So first we've got Batman bendable figures. Um, I believe they're based on the classic TV series. I've gone really dark. Um, you get uh, the Penguin, Robin, Batman, Catwoman and the Joker. Um, they are peculiar. I'm not sure about that. They're weird. Um, yeah, I don't know if you can see. The paint job isn't fantastic on them. But they're different. Maybe. Yeah. Next we have a tin action comics oh god uh, this is from the first appearance of superman which we got the actual issue in the ordinary loot crate so this is the tin front cover if you can see there which is that's pretty cool i don't mind that yeah i quite like that i don't know if there's a stand for it. Is there a stand? There is no stand. No stand for it. Uh, we've also got a uh, Detective Comics one, uh, which I assume is the first uh, appearance of Batman. Um, so, yeah, they're pretty cool. As I said, there's no stand. There are little holes so you can put it on the wall, um, which is okay, but yeah, they're pretty cool. And then we have the pin, which is a really nice pin, actually. It's Batman. You see that? That's quite decent. So it's got two pin things. That's a pretty nice pin, actually. A lot nicer than the ordinary pins. Quite plain. I like that. Again, I've still not decided what I'm going to do with uh, the pins yet, but I'll figure something out. Ooh, lastly, before the t-shirt, we've got a book, Art of Atari Capsule Edition, which is a Loot Crate exclusive, and I assume is just an art book with art from Atari games. Original art created for Atari's groundbreaking video games. Okay. I don't know if there's an ordinary edition to this and it's just a capsule edition is the Loot Crate exclusive. I don't know what makes it exclusive, if it's just the whole thing or not, but I'll have a look at that. Lastly, we've got the t-shirt or, oh no, it's a long sleeve t-shirt and that's the design. I'm not sure how I feel about long sleeve t-shirts. I don't think I've worn a long sleeve t-shirt ever. Um, but it's a cool Optimus Prime 1984. Oh, okay, so I assume that's what Optimus Prime originally looked like, or his original blueprints or something. I'm not overly au fait with Transformers, but that's pretty cool. I like the simple design. It's This is a small, um, and it's an official licensed t-shirt. Yeah, it's quite cool. I'll see how I feel about long sleeve t-shirts. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, 
my camera's gonna run out of battery. Will this reach? My camera died, so. Ta da! Yeah, that's a wrap for that. Hopefully I will get better at doing unboxings and I will have a better setup and it will be more enjoyable. But if you enjoyed this, then give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos. I do film reviews, random vlogs, unboxings, random film related videos and stuff. And I will have some short films coming in the future at some point. So yeah. Thanks for watching. I will see you soon. Bye.